Has there ever been a moment where you wanted to quit? If I wouldn't have failed so hard in front of everybody, I don't think I would have had the courage to even start butter. I felt like someone was always watching. I felt disrespected. I felt not valued. Because when you're sitting there and all you have are your thoughts, you really got to redirect what you want to take in and what you need to throw out. I had to put an end to some of the characters that I was asked to play based off of the romantic lead opposite me. And it was, it's rare that it's another black woman. I have like this mirror in my living room that I have to walk past to get to the kitchen. No bra on, and I'll be like, oh, you look this way, or you, you know, you need to do this. There was this voice that was so nasty to myself. It was a painful time in my life because I didn't really know who I was. I had some issues that I needed to solve with myself, with my family, with my mother. We have all faced insurmountable valleys, adversities in the last few years. What do you believe you've gained during this pandemic? During that time we had to stay in the house, I found that I was moving too fast in life in general. Like, I was always out. I'm incredibly sad. I'm incredibly lonely. I'm incredibly isolated. What if someone watching right now looks just like you? doesn't feel good about themselves. The nicer I talk to myself and would stick with it and refuse to say these negative things, people on my outward life started saying those things to me. Life is going life, okay? <laughs> okay, it's going to life. When those labels fall off, who are you? I'm a builder. Okay, so let me tell you a story I've never told anybody. This is really how Butter got started, for real.